We're in the heart of New York City, right outside Madison Square Garden, the world's most famous arena where basketball came to die. Where this week in the Westminster Dog Kennel Show is taking place. And kicking it all off is the 2017 New York Pet Fashion Show. Showcasing dog fashion from all over the world. Yeah, that's right. You heard what I just said. Dogs and dresses. Ready to go check out some bitches? No, heard that. Doesn't make sense. Okay. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. So tell me a little bit more about this cuckoo clock. Geppetto, hey, how you doing? Yeah, who are you puppeteering these days? <laughs> Bad joke. Which is the short <laughs> pants mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and the big. Jana, please, give us a second. We're representing the country of Mexico and uh, the famous holiday there of Dio de los Muertos. The Day of the Dead. Day of the Dead. Not Halloween. Correct. Because that's a different holiday. Correct. One day is for the adults who have passed, and the other day is for the, the children, the infants who have passed. Oh. So it's November 1st and November 2nd. And then uh, I didn't know that. Yes, as Paco does, and he's dressed as a mariachi Catherine. And then we have um, Polly over here, who's in the traditional um, Mexican color uh, peasant dress. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again because a vision softly. What is love? dog designer for the stars I designed for ice tea I just did a show with Anthony Anderson I'm the first and only designer to present pets on the runway in New York Fashion Week this is my fourth season where the dogs are the models and the women are the accessories he has a big bigger than life personality and what's your name there we go okay wow that is a bite bogey we got a bogey on my tail all right <laughs> And this is his twin brother, Kimba, so they're yin and yang, as you can see, yes. really quite a nice yes. so this is the feisty yes. one. I can see and that. The costume is called Bartoria's Secret. I'm feeling a little insecure about myself right now, just because <laughs> I feel like I'm underdressed. This is... Here are Gia, Pia, Mia, and Tia. That one looks like a Tia, that looks like Pia. Did I get that right? Close enough. Do we know which one's which? <laughs> I, I do, I sure hope so. I, right, I, I hope so too. And Pia got pregnant in doggy daycare here in Manhattan, so um, out came uh, Mia and Tia, who were born in my bed. <laughs> okay. So tell me a little bit about, about what your, your setup, your costume, your name, the breed of your dog, the dog's name, and, and what, what inspired you to, to, to dress to, to Hey guys, how are you? What do we have here? Tell me a little bit about what we're wearing. What was the inspiration? What are your names? Uh, Prince Snowflake and Princess Pussy Willow. She's named after uh, uh, Princess Pussy Willow. She's named after the Pussy Willow Bush. The, the, the what now? The Pussy Willow Bush. The, the, the breed of the dog is? It's cat. It's a cat. Oh, it's a cat. I didn't, two cats. It's, everyone has that thing. To walk on a runway show, to be a model, to do this. I'm not going to lie, I'm going to walk down it. Criticism, it, it, I, I don't right. mind. So what if somebody loves their dog? Exactly. And they all love their dog, their cat. We had a uh, rescue chicken who got snowed out. We had a, a bearded liz uh, lizard who got snowed out. We were going to have a rat, a, a rescue rat. They got snowed out. They didn't show up. but. Well, then I guess they didn't do a good enough job, uh, you know, crawling through their burrows, right? There's a lot of love, a lot of joy that these animals bring to uh, the world, and they want to, you know, just have give unconditional love, and they don't ask for anything. So we do these shows to raise money, and the money goes to the animal shelters.